the mobile version of Player Unknown's Battlegrounds, probably known as PUBG, one of the most played PC games of 2017, is now available on Google Play Store and App Store. Developed by Tencent Games, a subdiary of Chinese tech company Tencent, in collaboration with Lightspeed and Quantum Studios. The PUBG Mobile has been optimized very well for the smaller screen. It doesn't feel chunky during game sessions and surprisingly smaller in size. The Android version needs just 777 MB of space to install when the PC version takes up to 15 GB of space. It's a multiplayer game and works best on Wi-Fi network. Well, when it comes to gameplay and visuals, the developers have remained true to the PC version. Players can adjust frame rate and screen resolution for the best experience. There is an Ultra HD mode too for smartphones or tablets with 4K screens. Powered by Unreal Engine 4, which has been used to build console games such as Bioshock and Gears of War 3, PUBG Mobile is one of the best looking shooting games on the small screen. Well, the gameplay is exactly the same as PC version. Over 100 players are dropped on a remote island and have to survive until the end using whatever weapons they could find to kill others. As time passes, the playable area in the island shrinks and everyone, I mean anyone outside it dies automatically. Players have to remain within the area and that is what makes the game more challenging. Ah, bike. Players cannot hide in any one location and wait for the other players to show up but will have to move regularly to get to the playable zone. Players can arm themselves with weapons and protective gear they find on the island. The rate of survival and killing rivals depends on the quality and range of weapons one has. Navigating through the game on the smartphone can be challenging compared to the playing with mouse and keyboard on a PC or game controller on console as the controls are scattered over the same screen. Aiming on a target is not easy but the game has a precision mode which allows players to zoom in on the target and get better shots. Tencent Games hasn't left out any of the control options in the mobile game. Players can duck, dash, pick objects, drive vehicles, throw grenades and even jump over obstacles using on-screen controls. The on-screen map needs improvement and the option to zoom out for a more extensive view. Uh, the fact that the map doesn't show any of the rival players in the vicinity adds an element of surprise makes the game tougher. It can be played solo with one partner with a team having multiple players. During multiplayer games, players can also chat with their team members using their built-in messenger. Players can dress up the in-game character Avatar using reward points earned for every game. Surprisingly, there are no in-app purchases or advertisement in this game as of now. PUBG Mobile is as challenging and a little more frustrating than the PC version due to the controls only, but it is immensely addictive and hard to put down. So that was all the review and now you can enjoy my gameplay. Subscribe to my channel for more gameplays and I'll be uploading more PUBG, I mean player unknowns battleground gameplay soon as I progress through the game. Have a good time.